The Southern Hemisphere's most famous silverware was on hand to watch Manly take on Ramwick at Coogee and just minutes in the Marlins look set to post the opening points. Oh, has he got it? Not quite. Oh. Leon Bott's failure to convert his opportunity proved telling, with the opening honours going to the Wicks following a horrible defensive read by the visitors' back line. Miller straight through. He's quick enough. He'll get there. He scores the opening try. Well, they run it from everywhere, and then when they did get on attack, didn't they find an easy gap? The Ramwick fullback doubled the lead and his try tally soon after. The Galloping Greens playing with width and putting their passes on a sixpence. This time, Milroy will do it himself. There's a second for him and for Ramwick. Manly found themselves trailing by 14 and were playing with the same number following a moment of absolute madness from their winger. Dylan under this one. Oh, no, what are you doing? Leon Box. What are you doing? That is, that's a brain snap. Just stay out. Oh, sorry, too much. Something has to. That's not right. That's 10, isn't it? The Marlins rallied after losing the former NRL star, with Aussie Sevens player Brian Sefanea stamping himself as one of the form centres of the shoot shield. Who can he beat? He can beat a couple. Sefanea, he's there. Strong. Great work. It's been hard to handle all day. Very difficult to put on the deck. Rather than sparking the visitors to go on with the job, it was third place Ramwick who struck next. Waratah's prop Sakopi Kep who powered away from the cover defence to cross for the home side before seriously jeopardising his position in the front rowers club in the shadows of half time. Former ladder leaders Manly were aiming for a miraculous comeback in the second half and a catch from the Ashes handball gave them hope. Melrose. He's going Safanaya. Safanaya will get there. No one within Kui can bring around a little bit closer. And Safanaya has got a double. However, poor discipline cost them again, with Milroy adding a penalty following this James Lekepa high shot before Bernie Orbell put the visitors away for good. Marshall Milroy, great support. Orbell, Orbell will score himself. Ratuna Signiavi capped a forgettable day out with the final try of the match, giving Ramwick the eighth win from their last nine starts and moving them within just two points of Manly on the table. Sean Maloney for clubrugby.com.au